Hi guys and welcome to another Divi video. This is Jamie from System22 and WebDesignerTechTips.com. Well, we're using the Divi Supreme modules again today. Yesterday we did these little flip boxes, which are pretty cool. Today we're going to show you how to put this little animated infographic on your site. Really easy to do. So let's get started. Firstly, these graphics come from a, a little site and it's called Lottie Files. I'll put the URL down below. We just go back to their home page and we'll go to animations. And they've got all kind of different animations you can add to your site. Many of them are free for all the ones I use are free, but of course there's premium ones and you can request people to make certain ones. For instance, these premium ones are sort of six or seven dollars, 99 cents for a simple one like that. But most of these, all these ones up here are absolutely free. And they've got trending in there. At the moment, we're in the middle of the COVID-19 crisis. They've even got COVID-19 ones that you can put on your site here. Great one for washing your hands. So let's get started. Let's go back to our site and enable the visual builder once the vi visual builder is loaded let's go down I'll get rid of this little module right here I've got a row with two columns in it let's click on the add module button now all these light gray ones come as standard with the Divi theme itself these dark blue purpley ones are all the ones you get with the Divi Supreme modules plugin and you can download that from my affiliate link below this video if you want to try it out and today we're going to be using Supreme Lottie there it is right there I just left click and it's opened up now let's get us a file let's go to lottiefilesjustcom.com We'll click on that hand one now I'm gonna go ahead and download the JSON file you can change things about it here if you want to but we can also change it within the plugin ourselves so we don't really need to do that now if you haven't signed up it's absolutely free just put your email and a password in or you can sign up with Facebook it'll ask you to do so I already have so I'm just gonna hit the download JSON file right here at the top and I'm going to download a Lottie JSON. And as you can see, it's downloading it to my browser right here. So I can close that when I'm done. Now let's go back to our site and add an image. I want to go to Upload Files. And I'm simply going to drag my JSON file up here. I'm using Google Chrome browser so it downloads my files right to the browser itself there if you're using a different one it may upload it or download it to a different location your default location just drag it from there okay so I'm gonna upload the JSON file now with this little blue button and there it is there's your little animation all good to go in your site now you can have it loop which is what we want we don't want it to just do it once we want it to keep doing it so I'm going to keep that as a yes you can change the direction from normal to reverse not sure there'll be a whole lot of difference between this one I don't know if there's any difference or not there <laughs> you can speed it up by sliding the slider to the right or obviously slow it down by sliding it to the left Now at the moment when we hover over it, it won't stop because we're in visual builder mode, but normally that would stop when a user hovers their mouse over it. If you want it to continue playing with a mouse hovering over it, check that to yes. Now we're pretty much done. You can do all the normal things you want. You can add a border or a box shadow if you want to. For me, I like it just like it is. But that's a handy little thing to have on your site and really easy to do. Like I say, there's a lot of free ones out there. It's very little money to either have one commissioned or to buy one from their stock shelves. But that's a free one. That works perfectly for me. Let's 
go ahead and save our draft and exit the visual builder so there it is there's our little animation really easy to do and that's an effective little thing to have on your site that's going to get eyeballs on it straight away when it pops up so i hope you've enjoyed that and found it useful like i say we've been using the divi supreme modules plugin today if you have enjoyed it and found it useful please ring the bell give it a thumbs up comment share and subscribe to our youtube channel once again this has been jamie with system 22 and webdesignandtechtips.com thanks for watching have a great day.